What's up guys, Rampage here. Today we're going to be looking at auto harvesting dinos. And uh, we're going to start off with one you'll probably all know of. It's the Dodecarus. So, it can be on it can be on anything. I usually just leave them on neutral. Um, and just simple as a nibble wonder. As soon as it gets near a rock, um, it'll auto harvest it. So, so yeah, nothing in its inventory. A bit closer, and then off it goes. As you can see, it'll just go around harvesting the stone for you. You don't have to have it on wander, however, and you can actually use an RJ. So next up we have the ferry, and with this one, I've put all in air power harvesting, and as we go get neutral, and we'll just never wondering. And as you see, it will just go around harvesting wood for you. Wooden thatch. You see, yeah, you just leave it and come back to it when it's full. Okay, next up on the list is the Daedon. This thing is a berry monster. So, it's harvesting already. Um, so, if we. In fact, this disabled wandering. Rid of its berries and and never wondering. Go find my RJ. Now, if you don't know about this spot, it's here on the map. By far the best berry spawn on Ragnarok. I'll just move it into the middle. So just from that little bit of wandering, let's see already. And I'll just keep going around harvesting for you. I mean, you can set these up on trackers or you can set them up on a dino leash. I'd recommend setting up a dino leash here, but they tend to be fine. So we'll move on to the next. Okay, next up on the list is the moss chops. This thing is sort of jack of all trades. Um, I'll pretty much harvest anything: fibre thatch, wood, berries. Um, pretty much anything. If you've got it set to like leveled in polymer or primer, whatever, it will be better at that. But. Start setting it on wooden thatch. Let's just see, I'll go move it into the middle. With an RJ? It's okay, it's made its way to berries. Yeah. 
So yeah, as you see, it's gaining fibre, thatch, wood, berries. So yeah, they're, they're a little bit more delicate than other dinos. Um, but yeah, a lot of harvest off the nice for you. So let's move on to the next. Okay guys, next up on the list, the Gigantopithecus. This thing gains fiber like nothing else. Let's just remove that. Um, put it on Wander. Let's try and move it. It doesn't want to move. I'll move it with RJ. Now with these things you can pretty much set them down on Wander, leave them for 20 minutes, come back and they'll be slot capped to fibre. As you can see how much it's gained already. And if you drop them off in this spot they're, they're not going to go far. The only thing you have to worry about is the occasional wrecks. But if you think of any other dinos that I haven't put in this video, let me know in the drop down and maybe I can add them to the list in future. If you find this video useful in any other way, you should check out some of the other videos on the channel. There's a lot of content like this. But if you like the video, give me a like or a sub. Thanks guys.